Hi guys, I'm Rita. In this episode, I will show you how you can record uh, payments received from your customers. To do so, we need to go to section sales and there is subsection called payments received. To add a new payment, you can click on the red button plus new or we can click on this plus sign next to payments received. Select the customer from which you have received the amount. For example, I have received uh, 300, um, let's say 850. If there is bank charges added there, payment date, for example, I have received on 24th of May. Payment number, that's system generated. You can click on settings icon and change it if you want. Payment mode, I had a bank remittance and select the bank account if you have multiple in which you have received that money. You can add a reference, you can say deposit plus payment. Okay. And now I'm presented with uh, unpaid invoices. So for Happy Limited, I have free invoices. So I have an option to add a payment. From this 850, 350 really relates to uh, invoice 1008 because that was left amount what is paid. But 500 relates to invoice 1009. So just remove that information and add where you want the 500 to be uh, taken from. Amount received, amount used for payments, and if there is any balance, uh, it will show amount here, which haven't been allocated. In my case, it's all allocated. If you want, you can add some notes, upload remittance advice, and we can email thank you note for this payment. Once you have added all details and allocated payments to correct places, Click save. Okay. So now payment has been recorded with reference number deposit plus payment. There is which invoice is being paid and what amount. If we click on it, we can edit this payment. We can email, send an email. We can download or print. And also we can see a journal or delete this payment. So. In this episode, I showed you how you can record a payment if you have received from a particular customer and allocate to multiple invoices if they have done a batch payment. If you have any questions or require any further advice, feel free to reach out to me.